Tommy from Elvis Funhouse. Um, we are back from our weekend away. Yes. Um, the first ever Candles Creek Friars Road Antique Fair. That was quite an awesome day. It was. Well, actually, was. Weekend, it was, weekend. Yeah. We had our first stall officially. Elvis Funhouse is getting out there. Um, yeah. We sold some few stuff there. We did. We yeah. did. We okay. didn't do too bad. Not too bad at all. Hopefully, maybe we might see you guys next time. Yeah. Um, but weather was a bit against us. We've got flooding here in Victoria, so it's it's not the great. But we weathered through. Yeah, we made it through. We did. And so these are our vintage haul of what we what? purchased yeah. there instead of selling. <laughs> yeah. We bought it more than we buy. Sometimes, yeah. yeah. This beautiful vintage rabbit fur stall. Um, great little bargain that one was. Not in bad condition, but a nice little bargain. This beautiful 50s vintage scarf with this amazing imagery of this lady skiing. There is also a snowman and other little um, wintry, Christmassy items in there. Um, this beautiful vintage Australian um, tablecloth. Massive, beautiful decals. I'll definitely have to take some pictures of the full picture of that one. Um, I, got a, I bought a uh, 1940s um, Coke, uh, um, Coca Cola tray. It's a, uh, a chick sitting on a pier fishing, drinking a Coke. It's not bad, Nick. And over here we have a, I think it's quite early 1951, 52, I'm, I'm just guessing. Um, a Sheila drinking a um, Coke, and it's another nice, uh, good Nick um, Coke tray. Um, I purchased some of these um, 1950s made in Japan tin toys, they're all like T-Mobile Fords. Look at that guy there. Here's another toy we picked up, um, a T-Model Ford, made in Japan from 1950s. Same as the rest of the, all these ones here are 1950s toys. Um, this one here is a Fire Chief. It's in Maine, America from the 40s. Probably late 40s, maybe. Um, picked up a, a black and white um, cigarette um, packet. This one's a tin one. This one's probably, I don't know what year that would be. Probably 50s, I'm not quite sure. But it's a story with that. Um, when I was about six or seven, I used to pick up um, Cigarettes from mum and dad at a corner milk bar, and, and it used to be black and white. So I thought, oh yeah, I might as well pick that up. Bring back good days, sort of thing. Yeah. We also picked up this beautiful Indiana Dairy milk bottle, probably from the maybe 50s or so. Yeah, not so. exactly too sure. Not quite sure, but um, beautiful condition. Great, great graphics on it. Also got this gorgeous little whale ashtray. You put your cigarette in. The side here, and the smoke comes out the blowhole. The blowhole. The blowhole. Very interesting little one. We will have to test it out and see if we can film it for you. <laughs> um, we've got this beautiful Willow Australian tin for Eater brand nuts. Amazing graphics, still in very good condition. Um, we also have this beautiful plastic made basket that would have been someone's handy or hobby crafts. Could have been a ladies, it could have been a child's, I'm not exactly too sure. And two beautiful fish molds, a copper one and a beautiful glass one. I do love my little jelly molds. And here we are, pick up some um, bottles, um, totem bottles. Um, we thought, oh uh, yeah, we might go in a uh, Hawaii mm -hmm. tiki bar, we thought of that, so yeah. Locally made, they yeah. were from um, Mary Barra. Beautiful graphics though. Yep. And here we've got some couple of magazines we picked up. I just like the, uh, the style of them, like the 50s. Uh, one in six, yeah. Um, more magazines we purchased. We also got this beautiful little um, staffy. 
Um, it does have a brand underneath, but it's very hard to, to read. But he's a beautiful ceramic um, statue. And we've got these Plain Tree Tobacco Company tin. I think it's made in England, was it? Yeah, I think so, yeah. Yeah. Also beautiful graphics. Very fortunate to find them still with their a lot of vivid colour and print in them. We have this beautiful Mammy toast holder. Um, very unusual. I've never come across anyone else to go with my Mammy collection. I think that they are just an amazing time gone era um, item. And our little donkey salt and pepper shaker. I've been after one for a long time and this one is just so adorable. Beautiful colors and, and just the styling of him. Here we are, picked up a um, champion quick cooking white oats in a tin, that's not bad, Nick. And pick up a cigarette, um, I don't know what year that'd be, oh, I, reckon, I don't know, 40s, 50s, I wouldn't have a clue, but yeah, it's a um, tobacco um, smoking packet, so yes, cigarettes, so that's not bad, Nick. Picked up a uh, 56 toy couple bucks still good got this beautiful vintage handmade handbag um, it's one of the plastic woven ones with the um, wooden handles very nice our daughter picked up this beautiful hand-painted pin tray um, we got a couple of little ceramic frogs modern but they were just too as adorable not to our daughter also got this beautiful um, rabbit doily. Somebody would have hand stitched that. And our glass um, juicer. Because um, I accidentally chipped <laughs> the one we already have. Um, and this beautiful little green bowl. We're not sure if it's uranium or not yet. You have not checked. But it was just, I do have a bit of a thing for green glass. Um, and the beautiful yeah. turkey um, salt and pepper shakers and the uh, beautiful ashtray for Mrs. Broad what year would they be Sancho? I think well, mid century maybe 50s 50, yeah. it's, it's large, it's heavy but the oh, colouring yeah. is, is beautiful in it and Aurora, our daughter also got this, was given by a store holder this beautiful little Japanese children's mug that you're meant to um, write the name of and, and sell fire. It's beautiful. Little pixie design. So she I was actually given that. We couldn't believe it. Um, I think we've kind of covered most things. We got a um, we had we had an amazing time um, hopefully we'll be back on next year and our idea is to do some more stalls in our local area and hopefully we'll be able to see you there. Yeah. Have a fun night. Catch ya. <laughs>